to draw this uh, graph we first of all have to work out some coordinates so if we draw a set of axes and time and velocity where the time we're looking at over the first four seconds so 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4 and then if we put 0 into here nothing add 1 is 1 4 take nothing is 4 1, 4 is 4 if I put 1 into here 1 plus 1 is 2 4 take 1 is 3 and 2 times the 3 is 6 if I put 2 into here 2 plus 1 is 3 4 take 2 is 2 and 3 times the 2 is once again 6 if I put 3 into here we will end up with 3 plus 1 is 4 4 take 3 is 1 and 4 times the 1 is 4 I want to put 4 into here I get 0 so overall I get 0 from that we are able to look at drawing the graph which I've already looked at at 0 we're up at 4 at 1 we're up at 6 at 2 we're up at 6 at 3 we're up at 4 and at 4 we're at 0 and we draw a smooth curve through those points as you can see making sure that because that went across from 6 to 6 that we actually curve it around we are asked to work out the acceleration of the car when t equals 2 so here you would be expected to draw a tangent at t equals 2 this is preferably done with a ruler but the tangent needs to follow the line of the curve from that you find two positions that are acceptable for the um, gradient of that line so for example we could take a coordinate up there and likewise a coordinate down here and we establish how far we've gone down in this case and how far we've gone across so in this setup I have gone one two three units down so the gradient is negative three divided by and going across I have gone one three squares there, seven squares there, so two across. So the gradient works out to be approximately minus 1.5. And that equates to the acceleration. So the acceleration is minus 1.5. The minus sign implying that actually we have a retardation or a deceleration.